So it's like 9 o'clock in the evening and someone's decided to cut the grass in the garden. Isn't that lovely? Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I thought it would be a good idea to film my um, skincare routine for like my hyperpigmentation. You might look at my skin and say like, oh my gosh, it doesn't really have much compared to like some people. But I feel like the products and techniques that I use will kind of help you with pigmentation. And it's been helping me because I have like some on my cheeks here. Um, that's where I have the most at the moment and I had a ton around my mouth before but it's kind of dimmed down. I already did a video talking about the products that I use um, but today I'll be showing you how I do it. Um, it's I literally got back from work not long ago, took a shower and I thought why not film my skincare bit. And I do want to say as a disclaimer that some products that I use may not work for you and vice versa. One of the products that I will mention in this video which is bio oil, I've realised not a lot of people can wear it because they react to it. Um, personally I've never had any issues with it, that's my personal you know, experience with it and quite a lot of you have had good experience with it but then some of you that break out so as always please do a patch test with anything new that you're using, please, please guys. That's just going to avoid like breakouts and like all over your face and you know scarring and stuff like that so please do your patch test always, it's really important. Like my sister has super sensitive skin so she always always does a patch test um, otherwise like she can break out really easily. So my face is completely bare, I've washed it, I haven't put anything yet and I did want to mention my favourite cleanser at the moment. It's the Neutrogena Hydro Boost Cleanser Water Gel. It says it boosts hydration, leaves skin refreshingly clean and touchably supple and it has hyaluronic acid. Hyaluronic acid is basically an acid that's going to help your skin um, retain I think a thousand times more it, what, water than it's normally usually able to. If I, I hope I'm explaining that right. But basically it's just going to help your skin retain more moisture. Um, it's really good if you have dry dehydrated skin. I'm really sorry if you can hear the noise outside, I'm really sorry. This is the only like gel cleanser that foams up, that doesn't make my skin feel tight, that doesn't make my skin feel super dry, it's affordable and it, like for me, when the way I take my makeup off is just that I just drench my face in warm water, then I take my gel wash that foams and I literally just wash all the makeup off my face, that's how I do my, my re removal part. Um, because I find that when I use stuff to like take my mascara off, I find that I pull out so many lashes, that's why I do it that way. So literally I just put water on my face and then it kind of melts and make, makes my mascara really mushy and like I just literally just use this, like two pumps, foam it up on my face and I kind of do it twice so that I make sure that everything's taken off. Um, and sometimes I go for like a toner, but like I did really like my Bobbi Brown one But I go for it so quick and it's kind of pricey, so I'm just like not gonna buy it anymore So I thought let me just use something drugstore. I'm all for drugstore stuff and seriously this stuff is so good It doesn't make my skin feel so weird. I did also want to mention um, a mask that I forgot to mention in my previous skincare video And it's the Glam Glow Brightening Treatment. This is the orange one. I could smell this for ages, but anyways, the smell is amazing. It smells like candy, but it smells like sweets. It smells so yummy, like I literally want to eat it. And I really, really want to just scream out the window and be like, Excuse me, it's nine o'clock. People need to work tomorrow and that he's lawning his moan at nine o'clock in the evening. Actually, it's almost ten, so I don't know what this guy's thinking. Can you hear him? It's just proper doing his lawn out, just outside. I'm not going to be using this today because I did do it last week. So I do this every two to three weeks because it's exfoliating and it has like stuff in it that makes your skin sensitive to the sun. I've just gone on the website just to get some like details on it. It does say that it helps to get brightest, lightest and luminous perfect skin. Even It kind of evens out your skin tone. It also exfoliates. So I just feel like that because this has like grains in it, it exfoliates your skin. So while you're putting it in, it's kind of exfoliating. I don't I just literally just go like that and you can feel like I just apply it like that basically. 
and because it's like exfoliating your skin it allows your skin I feel like to absorb, absorb the ingredients better I have been using it consistently for like every two three weeks and I've had it for like over um, two three months now and I think this has been playing a big role at helping to even out my skin skin as well it comes in very very sturdy packaging as well and it smells amazing so yeah that's definitely something I would recommend the first thing that I do before anything is apply my serum or like tonic or anything like that anything water-based I put first the first things that I normally reach for first for pigmentation I use the ordinary alpha arbitin which obviously you guys know that I've talked about this before and the nip and fab glycolic shot this is what they look like today I'm gonna use alpha arbitin by the ordinary there's not any reason to that I kind of mix and match like sometimes I just change it just with the way I feel. I have been using the Ordinary one a lot lately, that's why I just want to keep on using it. I have been really liking it, but this one's really good as well at smoothing and brightening and evening out your skin. Um, the thing is, you can only use it at night time. Most all the products I use, <clears throat> I need to use SPF and protect my skin, so one big factor to like skin keeping your skin even and like reducing pigmentation is to use SPF like always protect your skin my favorite one is the body shop skin defense which is a really really good one but anyways today I'm going to be using the ordinary one so I literally just put like one two three drops this absorbs very quickly into my skin so I just really like press it in like it's already gone I've had this over a month now and that's where I am at with it. I feel like I would get two, month, two months worth of product in there and to be honest that's not, that, that's not bad because it, I think it was like £6 so super affordable. I'm just going to tie my hair back so it's out of the way. So another thing that I love to do is derma rolling and I use my derma rollers from Glow Girl Cosmetics. They have been doing so well lately, like their products, their derma rollers are so good, they've been selling out like crazy um, because they're just like really sturdy and good quality and I don't know, they're just really good. So they did send me the roll and repair face and body system. So this has derma rollers for your face, under eyes and your body which is cool. This is what it looks like. I do have a coupon code if you guys want to get 50% off, it's Anushka50 which is a really really nice deal to be honest like what i really love about glogo cosmetics like they're they're like all right pricing they've got good prices and i do look like all their packaging comes in these sterilized like hospital kind of looking things which is so legit like you know you're not getting weird stuff this is what it kind of comes as so you've got your body one your undry one and your face one and it's all gold packaging I hope you can see it. the lighting's really bad because it shines but that's what they look like so preferably it's best to do this first like before anything but I like to like put my alpha arbitrin on my nip and fab stuff first and then go in with my dermal rolling and then sometimes I just do it just like bare face first and then I put all my products in so this is what the face one looks like so it says on the back this has 720 needles, it's one point, it's one millimeter and it's for use on the face. They do also have a sanitizing spray which is super important to make sure that your your dermal rollers are well taken care of. Just spray it. This is just like alcohol to sanitize it. And then what I'm gonna do, I mostly do it, and to be honest guys, don't press on this. Just like, literally just like pass it over. So I like to go upwards and then sideways. I also really concentrate on this area as well because I have hyperpigmentation but I also have hypopigmentation where it's lighter. So like right there and there. It's so weird. So what this is going to do is going to like help force your skin to kind of renew yourself itself. Um, and it helps to produce like more elasticity in the skin, more collagen, and your skin's gonna just like look, help. It's gonna help your skin produce new skin cells, basically. 
So when it does that, the pigmentation kind of goes away. So it's so cool, you can just press on the button and click it off. So I'm just going to put the little one in, which is for under eyes. So I did not know you can do this under the eyes, but I'm going to just show you. Be super gentle guys, please. So I like to do it on my lips. Because obviously I have pigmentation on my lips. You're going to want to do this once um, every one week or every two weeks. Once you're done with the dermal rollers, make sure to just clean them, spray them, ready for your next use. Always try to sanitise them as much as you can. Today I'm going to mix my rose hip oil by The Ordinary and my bio oil. This is what they look like. I do put quite a lot of rose hip oil, but I'm just going to put like maybe like two, three drops, even four to five. It depends how I'm feeling. And I'm also just going to mix a random amount of bio oil together with it. And I've just mixed the two together and I'm just going to put that on my skin. Your skin's going to absorb the product so much better because you've done your dermal rolling. And I'm also going to put that under my eyes. Also put down my neck because I've got pigmentation on my neck as well. I could dermal roll with my body dermal roll it now. And also do a quick coat on my lashes for some reason. I don't know why I do this, but I have pigmentation on my upper lids as well, so I just do that there as well. But that's it, guys. I do go a bit red. I haven't really showed you guys how I actually dermal roll, which is a first time. But anyways, you do go a bit red. Make sure not to press too hard with the dermal roller because it will hurt. It shouldn't really hurt. It should maybe like you know you kind of go like that, but it shouldn't really hurt. I definitely recommend this kit because you've got like for your under eyes as well, which is so cool, and your body. So if you've got pigmentation on your body, it's perfect. Um, I'll leave like the links and the uh, coupon code down below and with all the links for the products I use. Um, I hope this video was helpful for you guys. Also, if you want to see um, a um, skin texture video, I'll do that as well. But next time I'll just show you how I do it instead of just talking about it and doing a separate video. I just really hope I haven't forgotten anything even though I wrote notes down. But this is what I do. It's what I've been doing. This is what has been working for me. I'm not really a professional, I always say that, but I make sure I do my research on the products I use. And I feel like, you know, when you use these products, it's an ongoing thing. I've been using my ordinary stuff for over a month now. I feel like that's been helping. My Glam Glow for like two months. Bio Oil has been over a year. Um, if you have any questions about any of the methods and the products, just leave a comment in the comments below and I'll answer all your questions. Um, thank you so much for watching. Give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe if you're new to my channel and i will see you next time bye